Greetings everyone and a warm welcome. In this video presentation, I will be covering multiple choice questions, MCQs, focused on the topic of hardware and software, focusing on elements of computer processing systems, CPU, peripherals, and storage media. Dear viewers, if you want to practice these MCQs, turn off the volume of your mobile phone during the first round. Then, in the second round, turn on the volume to check your answers. For MCQs on other topics, don't forget to subscribe to my YouTube channel. Let us try to solve some important MCQs one by one from the topic. Question 1. Which of the following is considered a hardware component of a computer? A. Operating System B. Microsoft Word C. Central Processing Unit, CPU D. Google Chrome The correct answer to question 1 is option C. Central Processing Unit, CPU Explanation The CPU is a hardware component responsible for executing instructions and performing calculations in a computer. Question 2. What is the primary function of the CPU? A. Storing data permanently B. Controlling input and output devices C. Performing arithmetic and logical operations D. Running application software The correct answer to question 2 is option C. Performing arithmetic and logical operations Explanation The CPU executes instructions and performs arithmetic and logical operations, acting as the brain of the computer. Question 3. Which of the following is an input device? A. Monitor B. Keyboard C. Printer D. Speakers The correct answer to question 3 is option B. Keyboard Explanation A keyboard is an input device used to enter data and commands into a computer. Question 4. Which storage medium offers the fastest access to data? A. Hard Disk Drive, HDD B. Solid State Drive, SSD C. Compact Disk, CD D. Digital Versatile Disk, DVD The correct answer to question 4 is option B. Solid State Drive, SSD Explanation SSDs offer faster access to data compared to traditional HDDs because they use flash memory technology. Question 5. RAM stands for A. Random Access Memory B. Read-only Memory C. Remote Access Method D. Random Allocation Module The correct answer to question 5 is option A. Random Access Memory Explanation RAM, Random Access Memory, is a type of computer memory that allows data to be accessed randomly. Question 6. Which of the following is an example of an output device? A. Mouse B. Printer C. Scanner D. USB flash drive The correct answer to question 6 is option B. Printer Explanation A printer is an output device that produces a hard copy of documents or images. Question 7. Which storage medium typically offers the highest storage capacity? A. Floppy disk B. CD-ROM C. A Blu-ray disk D. USB flash drive The correct answer to question 7 is option C. Blu-ray disk Explanation Blu-ray disks typically offer higher storage capacities compared to other storage mediums like CDS or USB flash drives. Question 8. The BIOS, Basic Input-Output System, is stored in A. RAM B. HDD C. ROM D. CPU The correct answer to question 8 is option C. ROM Explanation The BIOS is stored in ROM, read-only memory, and is responsible for booting up the computer and initializing hardware components. Question 9. Which of the following is an example of system software? A. Microsoft Word B. Adobe Photoshop C. Windows Operating System D. Google Chrome 
The correct answer to question 9 is option C. Windows Operating System Explanation The Windows Operating System is an example of system software that manages computer hardware and provides a platform for running application software. Question 10 Which component of a computer system is responsible for long-term storage of data and programs? A. CPU B. RAM C. Hard Disk Drive HDD D. Optical Drive the correct answer to question 10 is option C. Hard Disk Drive, HDD. Explanation HDDs are used for long-term storage of data and programs in a computer system. Question 11. What does the acronym USB stand for? A. Universal Serial Bus B. United States of Britain C. Ultra Storage Box D. User Software Backup the correct answer to question 11 is option A. Universal Serial Bus Explanation USB stands for Universal Serial Bus, a standard interface used for connecting peripherals to a computer. Question 12 Which of the following is a function of the motherboard in a computer system? A. Processing data B. Storing programs C. Providing power to components D. Producing sound output The correct answer to question 12 is option C. Providing power to components Explanation The motherboard distributes power to various components and provides connections for them to communicate with each other. Question 13 Which type of software acts as an intermediary between the user and the computer hardware? A. System software B. Application software C. Firmware D. Shareware The correct answer to question 13 is option A. System Software Explanation System software acts as an intermediary between the user and computer hardware, managing the computer's resources. Question 14 What is the purpose of an operating system? A. Running applications B. Managing hardware resources C. Providing user interface D. All of the above The correct answer to question 14 is option D. All of the above Explanation An operating system manages hardware resources, provides a user interface, and facilitates the execution of applications. Question 15 Which of the following is a removable storage device commonly used for backups and data transfer? A. Hard Disk Drive, HDD B. USB Flash Drive C. CD-ROM D. SSD The correct answer to question 15 is option B. USB Flash Drive Explanation USB Flash Drives are portable and commonly used for data transfer and backups. Question 16 The software that translates high-level programming languages into machine code is called a. Compiler B. Interpreter C. Debugger D. Linker The correct answer to question 16 is option A. Compiler Explanation A compiler translates high-level programming languages into machine code before execution. Question 17 Which input device is used to capture and convert handwriting or drawings into a digital format? A. Scanner B. Stylus C. Touchpad D. A webcam The correct answer to question 17 is option B. Stylus Explanation A stylus is used to capture and convert handwriting or drawings into a digital format, often on tablets or touchscreens. Question 18 Which of the following is an example of optical storage? A. HDD B. SSD C. CD-ROM D. USB flash drive The correct answer to question 18 is option C. CD-ROM Explanation CD-ROM, compact disk read-only memory, is an example of optical storage. Question 19 What is the purpose of a graphics processing unit, GPU? A. Managing system memory B. Executing program instructions 
C. Processing graphics and images. D. Storing data permanently. The correct answer to question 19 is option C. Processing graphics and images. Explanation GPUs are specialized processors designed for rendering graphics and processing images. Question 20 Which of the following is a function of the cache memory? A. Providing long term storage. B. Storing frequently used instructions and data. C. Managing peripheral devices. D. Running application software. The correct answer to question 20 is option. B. Storing frequently used instructions and data. Explanation. Cache memory stores frequently used instructions and data to speed up access times for the CPU. Thank you everyone. Don't forget to subscribe to my YouTube channel Education and Teacher Education at Shoki Bilal.